Eliminating distance skills really occurs when a charm, and one might wonder why, especially considering the fact that we can be at anywhere, anytime with just a touch of our fingers. So today we will be traveling with Google Earth and our first destination is Copenhagen, Denmark, and we are going to be visiting the Tully Garden. So at the moment Google Earth is taking us to Denmark and we are already there. So with our 3D visual we can see in everything at the in the city and two of the gardens is right over here we have the tour guide options down here and we can see images so i want to see how Tula looks like at night and it's amazing all the lights the culture the land of the vikings is right in front of us and we are experiencing it without even leaving our places and it's great and our next a uh, visit is going to be in Barcelona, Spain, and we're going to be seeing one of the most famous cathedrals, La Sagrada Familia, by the famous architect Antoni Gaudi. So Google Earth already took us there. This is the cathedral itself, and again we have the tour guide option down here. We have images that we can take a look at. We can come actually closer, right? Now we're seeing the apartments from the cathedral itself we have all these options and now we are even closer and we can take a look at different images it's amazing how close we can get to everywhere right now and it's just an excellent experience and our next stop is Paris and we are going to be visiting Eiffel Tower and Google Earth is already taking us there and we are already there. It's amazing how fast we are right now. And again, we have the tour guide options and this time we're going to take a tour of the Eiffel Tower. And Google Earth is giving us a tour, a virtual tour. And we have the 3D experience and it's amazing. We can see the city. We have all these options to take a look at different pictures. And it's amazing and this time also Google Earth is providing us some background information about the Eiffel Tower so Google Earth is an excellent tour guide for us right now but as we took this short tour without even leaving our places I felt that there was something missing because in Google Earth I wasn't there my experiences every time I traveled these places wasn't there the time that I shared with my sisters, it wasn't there. It was the loss of a traveler's tale, that's how Aurelio explains this. Our tale was not told in Google Earth. Everything that I felt, the cold, the weather, everything that I laughed about, they were not there. That wow moment every time I saw a new place, the Eiffel Tower, the Gaudi's Cathedral, that wow moment wasn't there. The connection that I made, the relationship, the conversation that I had, all these experiences were not there. My memories were not there. So in Google Earth, without those, there were just places to look at and have fun because it was the technology that were taking us there. But I know how it, how it felt like being there with my sister. And as Virilia puts it, Without the memories, we are losing our relationships. And without the memories, what's left for us?